Our goal uh, from day one, we, you know, when we start practice, we talk to our kids um, about success is going hard, coming out. We want 14 guys on the mat that'll go out and battle, uh, compete, uh, and fight. And I thought our kids came out and fought hard, um, and so that's all we can ask. Uh, go back to that, that first duel against against Red Oak, and I think it was the, the start that kind of got you guys rolling four straight pins, and, and you guys were able to, to move forward from that. Yeah, and that Red Oak duel, um, you know, it drew at a good weight for us, kind of in the strength. You know, we, we picked up some pins there. Kale Roller got, uh, you know, Devin McKay got us started, kind of a back and forth match, picked up a pin in a close match, and then uh, Kale Roller kept it going into Easton O'Brien, picked up a, a pin in a close match, and and uh, you know, right into Abram Moore. So we we uh, had had a nice start there, um, and uh, it, you know, it drew into a good spot there. Um, you know, Red Oak battled back. I thought the, their kids came and really competed well, uh, especially in their upper weights. They're real strong there, um, and uh, you know how far they've come the last few years. You know, they're they're really uh, improving, and so that's fun to see. Uh, you know, another Hawkeye Ten school getting better. Coach, just two seniors. Uh, coming out this season, the uh, expectation, not sure what you had, but here you are, the battling to the last match to get the state duels. Your thoughts? Yeah, you bet. Um, uh, yeah, we had some young kids out there. I thought Brian South tonight, um, you know, that was a big win for a freshman there, um, you know, in, uh, in a regional duel. Uh, overtime match to get that takedown that showed a lot of heart uh, you know uh, that's something to really build off of for him um, you know and like I said up and down the lineup I thought we competed hard uh, we, we fought to not give up extra points we fought to not give up extra bonus points um, and, and you know that was a fun high school duel uh, I, you know if you were here it was exciting and uh, the fans were into it and the kids were battling um, you know we're real proud of our kids I'm proud of their efforts uh, we tip our cap to coach Beeman and Humble tonight um, you know, they were, uh, you know, they, they did enough to get it done and, and they wrestled extremely hard too. Um, you know, I think that was uh, one of the better duels I've been involved in uh, the last few years. So that was a lot of fun. Unfortunately, came up on the wrong side of it, um, but I don't think it was a lack of effort. And that's, you know, that's all we can ask for as coaches. Um, you, you mentioned bonus points. Uh, that, that duel, both teams won seven matches and I think they had four pins and, and you guys had, had two. Uh, it just is when it comes to the dual format and two teams that are that evenly matched it can come down to some little things yeah that's it comes down to bonus points and we um, you know we uh, that's what that's what dual wrestling is about is can you score bonus points for your team and um, you know and I thought our kids were trying we really were competing um, you know I had a couple matches there that uh, you know we, we just weren't quite able to finish the deal but uh, you know and on the flip side we you know gave up a couple pins that um, but I, I don't think our kids uh, quit and I, I thought they fought hard uh, that's it. that's the name of the game is go out there and you know try to look for the fall or the tech or whatever and we preach that every day uh, turning a takedown into straight to the back and uh, some of those guys did that tonight yep. uh, what about the team aspect of it uh, you get in, the, in, a, in a dual atmosphere like this it comes down to the last match and You've got a bench full of guys that are that are rooting for for teammates. You know, a lot of people think of of wrestling as an as an individual sport, but the the dual format really leads itself to that that team aspect. Yeah, no, it's a it's a good thing. The kids worked hard this year, and uh, yeah, once the the ball gets rolling, I suppose the you know the team part comes in, and people just start taking care of what they do. So, uh, what about uh, going to state duels? What's what's the uh, goal once you guys get up to Des Moines? Obviously, try to win. Uh, not, I'm not really a fan of how it's set up right before the individual. I think they could change that. But uh, yeah, we haven't been there for quite a while, so I mean, the kids will enjoy it. Go out and you know fight hard every every uh, match, I guess, or every duel.